Hey everyone! Today we're going to do a butterfly mask. This is going to be a one stroke design. So first I start here with Superstar Yellow and I'm using a uh, Micum Teardrop Sponge to go ahead and go over the eyes because I do want this to look like a mask. Now we'll use our one stroke, and this is actually out of the uh, Color Punch palette. It's a really beautiful, almost magenta color. Uh, there's an orange and a light yellow in there. I'm also using my Protégé wash. It's a three quarter brush and here I'm using a series of similar um, movement to how we make leaves with one stroke and I'm gonna mirror what I did on one side to the other side Now I'm going to work my way and make one more small layer just to fill that open space that we have. And I really love it when it looks very floral type. Now here I'm going to do the antenna. And for this I just did some swirls and dragged down for the line. And the body of the butterfly of course. Here I'm using a Lowell Cornell round. It's actually a number four. And I'm going around the eye so that I can create that mask shape. I'm also using um, Superstar, I believe it's Plum. It's one shade darker than the red. And here I'm just going over the edges of the butterfly wings just to get a more crisp uh, line. I'll add teardrops at the bottom of the butterfly and dots just to give it a little more dimension. And here you can embellish as much or as little bit that you like, depending on how much time you have with your model. I'm adding iridescent glitter. And remember, you can find all these products at facepaintforumshop.com. Now we'll go ahead and load a white round brush. We're going to add dots to the darker areas of the butterfly to make it pop. And we're done. 
Thanks for watching everyone. Visit facepaintforumshop.com.